shit given, that's how we live it. Don't be mad at the system, it's simply how we've existed. I hear a lot of people. Hi guys, it's just me, Kia. Today we're going to be talking about the um, IMAX Mirror Teardrop, well, Teardrop Mirror by IMAX. Um, you can find these on Amazon, you can find these on Kirkland's. I originally was going to order through Amazon, but I realized that the reviews were not all that good. People have been saying that the mirrors arrived broken. So I then went to Kirkland's. The price was about the same on Kirkland's, but I was not located near a Kirkland's to do a store pickup. And this was a little bit before quarantine had taken place. So I did find the mirrors on Home Depot. And I did order these through Home Depot. And I picked, I did a store pickup. So... I'm not completely done with designing minds on how I really want them to look, but I thought these were very cute for anybody that wanted to possibly buy them. Now, as far as the price here, it is $58.50 per panel. So that is just one of these. Just one is $58. So to achieve a look, you would have to buy individual. So let's see, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. At what was it, 5850 times seven? So to achieve this look, this person paid $409. So do keep that in mind. I did not buy mine all at once, I bought them more so, maybe two at a time. But yeah, to achieve the look, it's kind of expensive. I do like this. I do like that it's not like a bright, um, not like a bright white, but like, you know how something can be so gold that it looks cheap? I like this antique-ish looking gold. It's not a super yellowy type gold, but it is a more of a dull looking goal and i absolutely love these i first saw them on pinterest okay stay tuned i'm gonna show you how they look so far in my house again i hung these up on the wall because i really have no place for them but i wanted them super bad so yeah stay tuned and i will show you how they look and where i have them at right now so guys these are the mirrors this is how they look they're really really nice they come individually, so this is not like one continuous picture. I bought these to make a look. It's just the uh, one here, and it has the, um, the screw hole at the top that you can mount them on the wall. But I thought it was really, really easy. What I did to get this staggering look, I took painter's tape, and I made a level line of painter's tape to the top. And then for the second row, I made another level line straight across of painter's tape. And then I measured 10 inches apart for each one. And that ultimately gave me the look that I was trying to mimic, the look that I saw on Pinterest. So I really, really like these. Um, I do like that they're not super, super gold. They are like an antique-ish looking gold. If I can show you that. I, I know I wish... That people would have gotten a closer look please pay no attention to my chair in the background i was over there lounging and cuddling and watching tv but as you can see that look there so yeah i really really like these they're nice um give you a side view as you can see they're really really flat to the wall they have a decent size weight on them and I mean, my experience with getting them wasn't so good. One came broke. I had to send it back. I needed to reorder. I finally reordered these ones. I finally uh, reordered again and then everything was fine. I did notice that one of them have like a little spot in the mirror. Don't pay no attention to them. They're kind of, they need to be cleaned. <laughs> but um, I will clean them. I had to move it. I had to rearrange my living room to work from home. So yeah, this is how they look. This is my finished look. And I really, really think that it. this is a very, very nice um, accent to a room. And there you have it. Very nice. Thank you.